is Michelle with Pink and Main, and today I'm going to be giving you a closer look at our June 20th summer stamp and die release. We've got some really cute stamp sets for your summer paper crafting, so let's get started. These are summer sloths, and these super adorable sloths are ready for the lazy days of summer. They're soaking up the sun, enjoying some watermelon. We've got good vibes and tan lines. Hello, friend. Enjoy the lazy days of summer and you're one in a melon. We also have coordinating dies to go with this set. Here's our next set. This is called Beach Unicorn and this unicorn is ready for the waves. It's got its little inner tubes on. We've got some palm trees, some tropical leaves. The sunglasses can be cut out to go on the unicorn. So cute. We've got eat, sleep, beach, repeat, make a splash. I hope your day is a splash. We also have coordinating dies for this set as well. For our third stamp set, we have Let's Flamingo. This is a six by six stamp set. So these are some really nice big flamingos. We've got tropical leaves and pineapples and this really beautiful, like regal almost uh, flamingo head that would look really beautiful on a card. So some of the sentiments are let's flamingo, stand tall, wear a crown, keep balance. You are, you are fabulous, tickled pink for you, and everything is better in pink. And I agree wholeheartedly with that sentiment. We have coordinating dies to go along with this set as well. We have one stencil releasing with this release. And this is a set of three stencils actually. So we have one set that has the leaves, one stencil that has the floral elements, and then one set that has the inside of the flower. And what that creates is a layered look of hibiscus flowers and leaves. It just gets, creates a really pretty background of hibiscus flowers. So I know you'll have a lot of fun with this layering stencil set. Check out our blog, our Instagram, and our Facebook page for all kinds of inspiration from the design team using these products. We're also releasing some really essential layered dies this release. Now, I don't know about you, but I can never get just the right size shape that I want, whether it's rectangle, square, or circle for my cards. And I always want them layered tighter than what I can get with, with other cuts. So we've got our layered circle dies. You get, I believe there's 21 dies here. That's a lot of circles to cut out. They are big. Our, our biggest circle die here is five and a half inches. So you can do some really big circles with this. Now they start at five and a half and they go down in size incrementally by a quarter inch. So you're gonna get some really small borders around these circles and that's what I really like. We have our layered square dies. So once again, I believe there's 21 dies here. That's a lot of squares. And the biggest one, again, really big, five and a half inches. So you could use some, do some really big squared cards or square elements for your rectangular cards. Or think about your scrapbooking too. These are perfect for scrapbooking as well because we've got some really big die cuts here. So there's lots of uses for these, for sure. They're gonna be a go-to staple in your craft room. I just know it. So these are layered rectangles A2 dies. So these are for your A2 cards. The largest one is four and a quarter by five and a half, which is the size of your A2 card. So you have a card base size rectangle here. There are, I think, 19 dies here. 
17 to 19. There's a lot of rectangles here. They go down incrementally again by a quarter inch. So they're really tight. You're gonna get some really small borders around when you layer using these dies. So these are for your A2 size cards, your five, four and a quarter by five and a half cards. But just wait, I haven't forgotten about you guys that like to make A7 size cards. I don't see dies for this size card very often, but A7 is your five by seven cards. So if you like to make those cards that are a little bit bigger, a little bit more like your greeting card size that you would buy in the store, these are for your five by seven cards. So the largest die here, and again, I think there's 19 dies here. You can check our website to make sure, pinkandmain.com. The largest one is five by seven, so really big die here, and they go down incrementally again by a quarter inch. So you've got lots of layering pieces with these dies, and I just, like I said before, I just know they're gonna be a go-to staple for you when you're creating your cards and other projects. So I hope you've enjoyed taking a closer look with me at our summer release for 2020. We've got some really awesome essential layering dies. We have a layering stencil set with a hibiscus flower, and we have some really fun summer themed stamp and coordinating die sets that I just know you're gonna love creating with. So until next time, keep living the creative life and head on over to pinkandmain.com and pick out your favorites now. Echo likes the summer sloth stamp set because he enjoys the lazy days of summer.